for this video, I just need to wear a lipstick. Hi and very welcome. My name is Mary. This is my channel Lumi Level Up and I'm a luxury lover on an average income trying to be more mindful with my money. This is the perfect video for every savvy luxury lover on an average income because it's about a brand new Dior clutch and a Dior lipstick case and four Dior lipsticks and all that together for only $190. That's the deal of the year, isn't it? Hmm, let's find out. We want to take a closer look at the new Christian Dior limited edition for Christmas, the Rouge Atelier of Dreams lipstick set, which comes with a golden clutch, a detachable lipstick case, a golden chain and four Dior lipsticks. One of them comes in a very beautiful limited packaging and the other three are technically refills that can be put in that one packaging, but they already do look better than the refills usually do, so you can just use them the way they are and you don't have to change the packaging. Minnie from Minx for All shared some beautiful first impressions on her Instagram stories. And I texted her to ask if she would be fine if I show them to you in my video. Since I don't have the answer yet, I cannot edit the footage into the video, because it might happen that I have to cut it out later again if she doesn't like it. But in case she is fine with me using her Instagram stories footage, you will see it here. And of course I will leave you her Instagram name and her YouTube channel down in the description box, so you can check her out. <laughs> As if anyone who's watching my videos wouldn't know Minnie. She's a Lux Community OG YouTuber. But back to the Christmas set. The Christian Dior Christmas sets usually get sold super fast. So if you want it, you shouldn't wait for your Christmas shopping. You should try to get it right away. On the US website, currently it is not available, but they do restock. So you should check back every now and then. At the time I'm filming this video, it is still available on the German website. But I'm not too sure if I'm going to order the set. And you will find out in this video why. Because the first impressions we saw, it is beautiful, sparkly, shimmery, golden, festive, Christmassy, but can be worn all year around as an evening clutch. If you want to check out the offer yourself, or if you already know you want to purchase it, I will put the link to the Dior online shop down in the description box for you as well. But if you're not sure yet, maybe watch this video till the end before you make a decision. When I first saw this limited edition set, I was like, wow. It's so beautiful. I want it, I need it, I'll buy it. Every year the Christian Dior Christmas sets, they hook me right away. And then I calm down and ask myself if I really do need it and if I use so much lipstick. And until now I always ended up not getting the set. They are very tempting, they are very tempting. Cause usually they come with a little case or a little clutch. And one could easily think, wow, at that price point, you get the high-end makeup and you get a free SLG or even a free evening clutch on top. And I'm sure we all have seen some of these videos where people convert a Chanel or Dior freebie, cosmetic pouches, and add some hooks, add a strap, call it a day, how to get a brand new Chanel purse for $200. I'm on an average income, but before I put hooks and a chain on a cosmetic pouch freebie and call it a Chanel bag. I'll go and get something cute from Zara instead for way less than $200. But no offense, you do you. And this year, no worries, Dior prevents us from putting any chains or hooks and does already offer us a mini bag with the chain attached. So, of course, my first impression this year has been very positive. Usually these freebie pouches that come with the Christmas sets are made out of fake leather or some kind of fabric. 
And then you could quite easily tell that it's a cheaper material than an actual bag or a cosmetic pouch from that brand would be made out of. Which of course is okay, it comes free. And oftentimes there's the little words Dior Perfume or Dior Beauty written somewhere visible on the outside. That's not the case this time. There only is a CD and going with a metallic hardcover clutch in gold, I think it's very hard to tell from the first look that it's a cosmetic freebie if you wouldn't know that piece and know it is. So my first impression, wow, 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 go for it. But I took a closer look. A Dior lipstick costs $38 and a Dior lipstick refill costs $30. So with this set you get one actual lipstick and three refills. If you do the math together they are worth $128 if you would buy separately and even be able to choose your colors. So $128 and the set costs $190 so technically it's not a free clutch this time. You pay $62 for the set, for the clutch and the chain and the lipstick pouch. For comparison, the Christmas lipstick set from last year included six lipsticks, one actual lipstick and five refills. So two more than this year and it was even 20 bucks cheaper. So in 2020 when you did the math it did still add up. You got six lipsticks and a clutch for free. But this year you only get four lipsticks and you actually end up paying for the clutch. Of course, if you want to think that way, it is only a teeny tiny amount to pay for a Dior evening clutch. So it's still not too much of a bad deal, right? Well, you get the lipsticks, you get the clutch and you get a lipstick case and a chain and you can use all of these separately, right? Actually, wrong. If it was the case and you could use each and every piece on its own, I think I might still be all in even though it's more expensive than it has been in the last years. But unfortunately, you can detach the lipstick case. It has hooks on both sides, so you can wear the lipstick case with the chain attached by itself and you can use it by itself. And if you do need a loose golden chain, you can of course use that one as well separately. But the clutch itself only has a hook on one side and you have to attach the lipstick case to have the hook on the other side so you can actually use it with the chain. The teeny tiny box clutch, you can either use it as an actual clutch without any strap at all and I think Therefore, it's too small. Who carries a tiny metal box in the hand all night long? I don't. Or, of course, you can attach the lipstick case to the clutch and then you can wear the bag with the chain, but only if the lipstick case is attached. And uh, I have to admit, I don't know how I feel about the shape of that bag with the lipstick case attached. Kind of untypical, maybe even futuristic, if I may say so. And somehow with that look it's again giving me more of repurposed beauty item vibes than actual Dior evening bag vibes. The clutch alone is not doing it for me and the clutch with the lipstick case attached is not really doing it for me. But I think the lipstick case itself is great. Louis Vuitton is selling a lipstick case on a chain for around $1,500. Chanel has ones as well, where I could not even find out the prices, but I would guess they are even more expensive because they are leather. So paying the $62 in the set that are not for the lipsticks itself for a Dior one isn't too bad. But honestly, who really needs a lipstick case on a chain? Who wears it as a necklace or even over the shoulder? What's even the point? The Louis Vuitton case is out of stock on the US website right now. So it seems like there are actually people buying these lipstick cases and wearing stuff like this. I'm none of them and I can not even imagine how and why I would use it. As decor on my vanity table or for taking pictures? Maybe, but never for $1,500. So maybe getting the Dior Christmas set with the lipstick case included and playing around with it is the right choice if you wanted to try a lipstick case on a chain anyways. If that's the case, maybe go for it.
But I think it got quite clear I didn't order yet and I think this year again I won't. I'm not a person who buys expensive makeup a lot since I'm not that good with makeup that it would make so much of a difference if I use the high-end stuff or the drugstore makeup. So it's really just the beautiful packaging for me that could get me tempted and sometimes does but usually it's not worth it for me and I only buy it if it's a huge sale. If the set would go on sale or would be offered by a retailer with a huge coupon code, I might consider buying. But since people are crazy and there will be enough around who are just snagging up everything and then try to resell the clutch for 500, 600, 700 dollar, promoting it as a limited Dior piece, without the lipstick, I guess chances are not too good that it will go on sale for a good price. If you tend to buy a lot of high-end makeup and you buy a lot of Dior lipstick, it still might be a good deal for you. Yet still, the deal on the cosmetic itself is not as good as it has been in the past years. We did the math, we calculated. In the past, you paid the price for the lipsticks and got the pouch for free. And this year you end up paying for the freebie. On my Instagram, it's lumi underscore level up, little self promo shout out here. I did a little poll in my stories to check out what you think. You see the results here. I ask if you think it's worth it and most of you were like, no, 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 it's not worth it. I had a hard time this time deciding, but in the end, I'm glad I took the time and took a closer look and came to the conclusion it's not worth it for me, full price. Maybe if I can score a great deal at a great sale. What's your opinion on the Dior Christmas set from this year? Are you considering to get it? Or did you get one of the past years and enjoyed it? Make sure to let me know your experiences in the comments. Thank you so much for watching. Hope to see you next time and bye! <sighs> Is the light too light? Is the light too light? Is that even a sentence? But see again, the Christian, the Christian, Dior already, the cri Dior prevents on Dior. And here is a video YouTube is recommending for you to watch next. And I have no idea what YouTube will recommend because I never talked about Dior before on my channel and I never talked about lipsticks. So, hmm. Who knows what YouTube thinks is a good fit for you? Here you can subscribe.